Hi friends, I'm Jocelyn Peters. I'm the maker and designer behind Mountain Song Designs and welcome to this quick announcement episode. Guess what? Today my Luminous Are We cowl comes out. It is available right now. It's on Ravelry and Etsy. Um, you can get a discount right now, 30% off through May 10th, 2024. Um, use the code May the 4th. I'll put it down here so you can see it but check this out how pretty is this now these colors they are yoda colors because luminous are we comes from a quote from yoda luminous beings are we not this crude matter and i will share more about that in my substack post if you go to substack mountain song designs you will find a bit more about that You'll also find some better discounts, so you might want to check that out, especially the opening weekend. It's the best one. So be sure to check that out. Uh, if you are already subscribed, thank you, and make sure you check your email. But this is it. Now look at this. Isn't it just so pretty? You need, need two skeins of fingering weight yarn. Um, and this looks a bit more complicated, but it's really not. It uses a really cool slip stitch technique. Um, you've got the garter stitch down here and my double chain cast on. I have a tutorial for it. If you have not checked it out, make sure you check that out. Um, and some nice ribbing up here to help it sit however you want it to. You can fold it in easily. You can keep it out if you want to. Now, I love this because it is um, kind of funnel shaped and it sits so well. And you can wear this a couple different ways. You can wear it kind of the way I am now. I could even bunch it up more, you know, if I'm really cold out. But if I want to spread it out a little bit, show it off, um, I could shift it forward make it look more like if I were wearing a shawl. That's kind of how I like to style shawls. You do it on one side or the other, or you can wear this as a capelet. You can bring it down and kind of, you know, fix it however you want it, but it will stay and it is just so lovely. It's so, this is a great way to play with color. If you want your fandom color, like I have my Yoda colors, my green and my brown, you can't. Now this yarn is Wonderland Yarns Marianne in the Rocking Horse. I'll put it down here <laughs> with what the colorways are so I don't get them wrong, but they are gorgeous and I love them together. This yarn was so fun to work with. It's the same yarn that I used for my DC scarf. And you will notice that these are kind of sibling patterns and they are, they, um, you can see this up close. Isn't that just so pretty? I love this type of slip stitch, um, knitting because it's not overly difficult and you end up with this really cool kind of patterning. Now this has decreases. You see them here and that's what does the shaping. Um, and I think it's just a really cool thing. Now, I like how the decreases make it look like a Jedi cloak. Um, also, it reminds me of like the towers of tradition on which the Jedi Order was founded. Um, let's, I like Star Wars. Um, and if you do, that's awesome. It's perfect for May the 4th. And if you don't, that's okay too. Find two colors that are just pretty together or find some fandom colors. There are so many yarn dyers who have uh, specific fandom colorways and sock yarn is easy to come by. Um, and just find two that you like together. It can be high contrast. It can be a little less contrast and it can be, you know, very little contrast if it's something that you love. So, um, be sure to check this out again, Ravelry and Etsy and Mountain Song Designs or Jocelyn Peters. Uh, so be sure to check it out. And if you do knit this, I want to see it. Make sure you post it on Ravelry in your projects or on Instagram. All of the information for that is in the pattern itself. So thank you so much for joining me. I promise next time I will have a longer episode and show you all the things I've been knitting recently. But thank you for joining me and have a wonderful day. Slan and happy knitting. Bye.